Hmm? Hey, bud. 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 Hey, 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 hey. Buddy. Wake up. Wake up. Hello. Buddy. Hey, hey. Hey, bud. 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 Bud, bud. Hey, I was listening to that. Well, look at this, then. Huh? Oh! <laughs> Uh, hi guys! Sorry! Thank you, bud. No problem. Uh, <laughs> didn't mean to. I was just listening to some, uh, ABC. Uh, but, uh, and no, not the A, A, B, C, D. I, uh, that was an A, B, C, you know, Jack's five song. Uh, anyways, you probably know why we're here. Yup. And that's the review, My Hero Academia, to, uh, Heroes Rising. My Hero Academia, Heroes Rising, he meant. Yep. Uh, now this, this was a movie that I just said that me and Ethan just recently saw. So, there's actually going to be a bit of a two-part to this. This first part is going to be no spoilers for the movie at all, all except for basic plot, plot points, so me and Ethan can explain it a little bit better. Uh, but other than that, it will be like our usual critique that we did with the Sonic movie. Yep. Uh, the second part of it will be a somewhat speculation video. And spoiler alert. Yep, that will be spoilers for the ending of that one. Mm -hmm. So, ju just a heads up on that. Uh, but, um, no, spo uh, no spoilers other than the basic plot points of the movie, movie for this one. Uh, on... Uh, heads up too. Unlike um, My Hero Academia, two heroes, Heroes Rising is canon. Where uh, two heroes wasn't. Mm, well, maybe it does take take a place after the one episode, but eh, maybe it is not a canon. Uh, we'll have to look up and see. Yeah. Uh, but as far as I know and have noticed, it's technically not part of the main timeline of my academia's story. Yup. Um, but this one for sure is. Mm -hmm. So, uh, yeah. Okay, so without further ado, uh, uh, I'll explain the basic plot points, then we'll go over the usual. Music, uh, action, story, story, and of co co course, uh, the overall appeal of the movie, and then Obviously, our review number. Yup. Alright, so, the basic plot is, like I said, this takes place after Season 4 of My Hero Academia. Academia. If you haven't seen Season 4, what, what, what are you waiting for? Go watch it! Well, I bet you that Season 4 is still, still going, by the way, guys. So, what we're trying to say is, it does take place after Season 4 is, boop, you're done. Yeah. So, definitely keep an eye on that for the very last episode of Season 4. But anyways, continuing on, on in My Hero Academia, uh, 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 Deku and his friends are on a subdued island. Or we should say his classmates and Class 1A. Uh, on island, taking a bit of a, how do we say, project. Uh, basically, basically, this island is full of full of uh, villagers, villagers, but the climb level? Extremely low. It's even more lower than Japan, actually. Well, Tokyo, Japan. Yeah. Well, the fictional Joker Tokyo, Japan. That well, we're not talking in real life. We're talking fictional. Yeah, the fictional one in the series. Uh, and in that one, uh, and on the island, well, let's just say, say, um, this is little girl. Who doesn't believe in heroes? Well, in fairness, she believes in an all my more than <sighs> than Deku. I do personally, not her. Yeah. So Deku and the crew, uh, Deku and the crew are taking making this little po uh, project. Well, they have to help out the people. Even though the clients are kind of minor, uh, pretty much minor, or almost non-existent, this, that it's part of a educational program, I guess? Yes, and not only that, they're, the Class 1A is actually assigned 
to go over there without teachers, without mentors, or even all my too. So let's say they're on their own, pretending they're actual pro heroes to save the citizens over there. And not only that, the boy, let's say, he has some kind of mystery things behind him. Then when that girl, when Deku looked for him, and and guess what? That's when MC puts the point right there. Yeah, that's when we gotta stop. Because anyone beyond that point, then it's gonna leak into super spoily territory. It's really hard to do it with anime, because anime is kind of hard to really explain. And do not worry, guys. We didn't spoil the juiciest part for you, just so you know. Yeah. Uh, all right. So, first of all, oh, let's talk about the music. Now, the music! Oh, that's kind of obvious. They took of some from season... Well, let's say from the anime. Let's say that. And I gotta say, it sounded absolutely amazing. It's pretty good. No kidding. Kidding. Probably some of the best orchestra I've heard in quite some time. Yup. Uh, now the action. Oh, this is obvious. The action was just... Mmm. How do I explain it, guys? How do I explain it? Let's just say... It's even come close to, like, Dragon Ball Super Broly action. Oh, and that's juicy action. Uh, and that's coming from Ethan, mind you. Yup. Uh, let me see, what else? But instead, it's like... How I explain it? Like, Marvel's... Let's say it's like, Avengers movies. Basically. Uh, <laughs> but without the whole infinite warfare part. And Endgame, yes. Uh, so, yeah. Uh, oh, one other thing. I can't tell you why, why, or who it is, but the villain in this movie, he is ten times better than... The run from two heroes. Or even, even Dare says... Did I say, or did I even say already? Oh, wait, uh, that's right, I did say. Better than all for one. All for one. I, we can't say why. We really can't say why. Reason why, because that's to the spoiler part. Yeah, but he's definitely, in my personal opinion, this villain should have been in two heroes. <laughs> Would have made the story ten times better. Yeah. Because, no offense, but for those who didn't see two heroes, or two heroes video, I will leave a link in the description below for that. The movie didn't suck, but it could have been a lot better. I don't worry. I think it was great still. Me too. We're but just criticizing about the villain. That's it. Yeah, the movie could have still been uh, could have been one hundred percent perfect if it weren't for the villain. That's what this movie has over that one. Yup. Uh, let me see what else. What else? What else? What else? We talked about the music. We talked about the story. We didn't talk about. Ah, uh, what we talked about earlier. Ah, uh, I know we talked about the music. I know we talked about the story. Not the characters, right? Oh yeah, the character, uh, the ca characters. Obviously, uh, as Ethan mentioned earlier, Class One A is in this movie. All Class One A students, like Deku, Bakugo, you you'll be familiar with it if you guys catch up the anime. If those of you do not. Well, go ahead and start watching first episode of first season if I were you. Uh huh. So you guys understand. Yeah. Uh, there are, of course, some new characters like that little boy and girl we mentioned. And the little boy plays a crucial role in the story. Yep. It kind of reminds me of... Don't worry. This is not... Okay. Maybe a little it is. But that's a different... That is the first Mayogi Damian movie, though. It reminds me of... No. Actually, no. Okay, okay. How about this? It's like a character from season four. That's it. That's what it reminds me of. Yeah, another character I think I know who Ethan is referring to, 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 that plays a crucial 
part in season four of My Hero Academia. Mm -hmm. I can't tell you who it is. Is because again that's actually going into very spoily territory. Let's just say it's a it's a girl. That's all I can say. Yep. Uh, but that boy plays a, the same crucial role in the story. Not the girl in the uh, movie. I meant the girl in season four. Yep. You guys will know what I'm talking about. Yep. Those of you who don't, that's fine. That's uh, cool. Uh, yeah. It, it wouldn't make sense if you haven't watched the anime yet, anyways. Yep. Uh, let me see. What else? What else? What else? What else? Hmm. You said about the act. Wait, we were talking about the action, actually. Yep. Hmm. So, story, mu music, movie, action. I guess a wrong opinion, maybe? Yeah, I think that's about it. it like I said, this one was going to be a little bit shorter because. Unfortunately, unlike the Sonic movie, we really can't give away too many details because this one is. Really can into the story this time. Yes. Uh, so, yeah, overall opinion. Now, like I said before, for, or I should say, like I said on Wednesday when me and Ethan went to see the movie, movie and we live streamed shortly after, mm -hmm. me and Ethan both, uh, both said that it was, uh, it was a pretty, pretty, pretty good mo movie. Or great. But uh, now it's time for our official numbers. So, Jomo, please. I'll do mine first, obviously, folks. And my verdict is 9 out of 10. And I think there's a reason to it. It's not perfect 10 like I give two heroes before. The reason why I give this one 9 out of 10 because... This is gonna be this is gonna be to be continued part two right after this for me. Let's say it's a great movie and it's a great action impact, but there's one problem. The ending it was confusing to me. It was confusing. For anybody buddy who knows what Ethan's possibly talking about 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 if you say the spoiler, you will be banned from the channel. Or I'm temporarily suspended. <laughs> yeah, not only like that though, guys. I would give it perfect out of ten if it weren't for that conversity. Uh, my conversity opinion. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, I'm probably gonna be surprised when I gave the movie uh, the movie myself though. And one more thing too, before I go ahead and let MC take care of his. This is gonna put down to the. The manga readers. But this will be a part of the inspection video after this. Yeah. That's what uh, that's what Ethan meant. Man. Which won't be recorded until the day after the recording of this recording. <laughs> yep, 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 yep. Uh, but yeah. So, uh, in, uh, uh, in other words, for my hit for um my hero uh acad for my hero academia, Heroes, Heroes Rising, in my opinion. Drum roll, please. Nine point five out of ten. Uh, yeah, so that's a bit higher for a reason, because he hasn't paid attention to the manga readers and he hasn't known the anime. But that's a reason to it, and there's more than that. MC will tell you. So, I really liked all the action in it, and the f mm -mm, I mean, certain parts, phew, nearly spoiled it. Uh, and some uh, parts of it just made me feel, ah, oh, I haven't never even tell me about this. So, and the music was just, oh man, oh man, man, it felt like I was, a, I was watching a side movie again. <laughs> <laughs> and, and another thing too, guys. So, let's just say, I did ask him the question yet last night, we were after the, after live stream last night, I asked him this question. I asked him, what do you think in, in your opinion, MC, that which, all the anime movies you watch in theaters, what's the best one in your opinion? And guess what he said back? I can read number what he says. Let's say he said, he can't choose them all, but because they're all are so good. 
there is one part you'll be a little shocked, but maybe not. Those of you guys. Guess what he prefers all if he had to choose one? Guess what? He prefers One Piece Stampede. Yep. But I'll explain that in a probably a uh, my uh, One Piece season review uh One Piece series review. Mm hmm Uh but um yeah. Speaking of which, since we will be reviewing the series series soon, you and I are gonna have to definitely watch the movies. Well, the classic one. Well, there's more than just one, actually. How many do we have to watch? Probably more than five, that's for sure. Five? I said more than five. Do you hear what I said? Uh, I hate you too, animation. Well, let's just keep our pace. Don't rush ourselves. Fair enough. But, uh, seriously, though. So, that's, so, yeah, that's a My Hero Academia movie review. As I said, we kept it as spoiler-free as we could. And you slipped. Nearly slipped. But, but, I'll let you know this, after this part, here comes expectation more mostly on me, because I know the most of the anime, but MC can join in for that too, so he's going to be able to point out to what I'm saying, and he's... And he's going to point out what he knows, and I can point out I know the most. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, so, like I said, uh, the speculation video will be after this. And this video will explain basically the whole sum of the whole, uh, uh, the whole sum of the ending of the movie. So, if you guys do not like spoilers, I would recommend waiting, on wa uh, waiting until you've watched it. Watch mm -hmm. it, and once you've watched it, then come back, come back to the vi speculation video, and join me and Ethan as we talk about what we think of the movie. And not only that, guys, and not only that, I thought we discussed this before, MC. Um, I thought we're gonna do is put an speculation during our recording uh, during this part tonight. So that's what I try to understand the whole thing. Ah, oh yeah, yeah, yeah. That's true. That's truly true. True. Uh, for what? Speculation. Oh, yeah. Uh, we will record it, but, um, uh, we're gonna do it after you go see it again with a friend tomorrow. You did say you were gonna do that first. Mm -hmm. Uh, unless, of course, you want to do it tonight. Doesn't matter either way. Uh, uh, I guess we'll do it tonight, then. Yep. Alright, so, thank you all for tuning in, uh, tuning into this video. Uh, please like and subscribe to us. Um... Also, if you haven't seen my and Ethan's movie review on the Sonic movie, well, what are you waiting for? Click on the card in Ethan's corner right over here, and you can see see my and Ethan's uh, review on the Sonic movie. S spoilers, not really. It was good. No, great. Uh, good. No. Ah, uh, good. Eight. Hey, no. Awesome. No. Outstanding. No. <laughs> Amazing. <laughs> Probably better than you'll be surprised. Better than Detective Pikachu. Yes, better than Detective Pikachu. Sorry, Pokemon fan. Fans, I'm being honest. And it's coming from a veteran who's been there since Pokemon Gold. Yup. It's about even me as a gamer, too. Uh, so, yeah. Alright, see you later. Yeah, you know, my academia fans, this is yours truly. Yup, and this is Ethan, signing out. And, and well, this is just for the theme, for the anime, so we could do this for for my idea. Let's say, go, let's go beyond. Let us ultra. ultra. See you next part. See ya.